Hi and a huge welcome to Steve's Kitchen. Are you all familiar with overnight oats? I'm a late comer to the party. If you are too, I really want to share this with you because I think it is a secret we should all know. Whilst we've been traveling the last eight months, I have eaten really well and a lot of calories, but on a little bit too much weight. So I'm looking for something wholesome, delicious, and inexpensive to make. And overnight oats has come to my attention. They are so good. Just take a look at these. Now, if you haven't made overnight oats before, now's your chance. I'm going to show you how, and I bet you're going to love them. The ingredients are super simple. We've just got some regular flat oats here. Pop them into a glass of your choice. That is half a cup. Use traditional flat oats. Don't go for the fast oats. They've been processed already. You might as well have something natural that's got a bit of texture. Now I've got some organic almond milk here. Uh, I'm not gonna make this with regular milk, though you could do, but I just want that extra healthy level. So I'm taking half a cup of almond milk and I'm just gonna pour that over the top of my oats. No need to stir or do any processing at all at this point. Take another one, pop it in there. I've got a different size glass, same process. Next, I'm gonna take some unsweetened plain yogurt. Just two or three dessert spoons on top of the oats. Now we're gonna sweeten this, but not too much. And I'm using an organic agave, but you could use maple syrup or honey, whatever you like. And it truly doesn't take that much. I'm just gonna take a teaspoon of agave syrup and drizzle it over the top. And next, we're just gonna to top it with a lovely summer fruit of your choice. Now I've got an apricot here. I'm just gonna take it. And then I'm going to dice this up then we put those apricot cubes on top of our yogurt, a sprinkling of fresh blueberries, and that's it. No cooking, no baking, no anything. If you want, cover it over, pop this in the fridge, and in the morning, you are gonna have a beautiful, healthy breakfast to start the day. Now this one I've done with mango and blueberry, and I'm just gonna get in there now, and we just mix this through, and you're good to go. Man, that is delicious. It just tastes so healthy. It is so fulfilling as well. Sets you up for the day. Now, if you haven't tried overnight oats before, I implore you to give it a try and keep it simple at first. Now, I've seen recipes where you can add chia seeds and bran and all sorts. This tastes delicious just as it is. I'm gonna experiment with a few. I'd love to hear your comments and your recipes, and maybe I'll do some other overnight oats a bit later on. But for the meantime, I'm just gonna get on and enjoy this and watch the pounds fall off. So share the love, share this video with your friends, give this a thumbs up, and I will see you in the next video. Take care. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, subscribe to Steve's Kitchen. There are 500, 600 recipes already on the channel. Uh, you can try this with so many different fruits that are in season. Give it a go and let me know what you think. Take care, and I'll see you in the next video.